Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error. That is security violation. Secure boot is not enabled on this machine. So whenever you launch FIFA 23, if you are receiving this error message, then please follow the steps shown in this video. So click on OK. You will receive two, three error messages more. Just ignore it. Click on OK. Now type in MS Info 32 and go to system information and then find secure boot state now over here under system summary here you can see secure boot state right now it's off so i have to enable secure boot on my computer now for this first of all shut down your computer now after you shut down your computer you have to go to the system bios now once you shut down your computer start your computer and immediately keep tapping the bios key now the bios key on dell computer as soon as you start the computer, immediately when you turn on the power button, as soon as you start the computer, for Dell computer, press F2, it will take you to the system, system BIOS. For HP, for my HP computer, F10 is working. So for different brand, the BIOS key may differ. So find your BIOS key, you can Google it and go to system BIOS. So first of all, shut down your computer. Now, once you are on the BIOS screen, you can go to, you can use the arrow keys, left and right arrows key or up and down arrow keys and go to boot option. Now, once you go to boot option, scroll down, use the down arrow key to go down. Over here, you can see secure boot, which is disabled right now. So once you select it, hit the enter key on the keyboard. Now it's, it's telling me secure boot enable or disable. You can select enable and then hit the enter key. Now, once done, now go to exit option. You can use the side arrow key exit and now save changes and exit. Hit the enter key. Click on yes. Now after the system restart, log into your computer and in the search box again, type in MS info 32 and then click on system information. And over here, secure boot state is on right now. And now you can launch the game and you should not receive the error message again this has worked for me so it will work it should work for you but still you are facing the problem in that case uninstall ea anti-cheat and then reinstall it now for this go to the game installation folder now for this open file explorer on your computer and then go to this pc now if you have installed the game on c drive open c drive go to program files and go to ea games you you might find the game over here. Now, if you have installed the game from origin, then go to program files x86 and then open the origin games folder over here. You will find the game folder. Now, if you have installed the game from e app, in that case, go to C drive and go to program files and then go to EA games over here. You will find it. Now, in my case, the game is installed in e drive. So I will open the FIFA 23 folder. So open the FIFA 23 folder, then open the installer folder. Now open EA anti cheat folder. And over here you will see EA anti cheat installer exe. Now make a right click, then click on run as administrator, then click on yes. Now click on this drop down option, select FIFA 23, and then click on uninstall. Now again click on install. And over here you can see install success. Now, launch the game. Still, you are receiving the error message, then uninstall EA anti cheat. Again, go to the game installation folder, make a right click over here, and then click on run as administrator, and then click on yes. Now, select FIFA 23, uninstall. Now, don't install it. Close this window. Now, go to Origin or EA app, and now click on play. You have to launch Origin as a as an administrator so close this if you receive this error message so after you uninstall ea anti-cheat if e app or origin is open close it and then open origin as an administrator so make a right click and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow now go to library and then click on FIFA 23 and then click on play
Now over here you will see reinstall EA anti cheat. So click on reinstall EA anti cheat. Successfully installed EA anti cheat. Please relaunch the game. So close this. Now launch the game. So over here you can see the game is launching successfully. So this is how you can fix it. Now still you are receiving the error message then please follow the steps from this video. Now I made a separate video over here. Now the error is different but please try steps from here. There is a long troubleshooting steps. So you can follow this. So for many user these steps have worked so you can try this. So one of the steps should help you to get rid of the error. So that will be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.